What is going on guys? Grave here today. We had an update for the console version of the Elder Scrolls Online. I will link the patch notes for PlayStation and Xbox both down in the description if you would like to read over them for yourself. This was a small update. Let's go ahead and hop right into it. Kind of give you all the details of what went on. First of all, they fixed an issue in the Deadlands when some of the drop sites were extremely difficult to interact with. When it comes to Vodastron Hollows, using the grappling hooks in some encounters will no longer cause your camera to point in odd directions. When it comes to the crafted set Night Silence, they fixed an issue where the set was not actively or activating properly in many cases, and the set now works in no proc Cyrodiil campaigns. The Turning Tide Dungeon set, they fixed an issue where this set's damage was not uh, respecting its own cooldown. Also, for general fixes, added sound effects to the bird flapping wings when using the free bird emote and claiming a daily reward will now play the appropriate audio. Also, they fixed an issue where you can complete multiple alchemy crafting writs per day on the same character that has been fixed as well. When it comes to some other fixes, they fixed an issue where the game appeared darker than prior to update 33 on PS5. I talked about this in a video uh, after the update came out. The game seemed really, really dark. Uh, hopefully that has now been kind of worked out. They also fixed an issue where your camera would occasionally be forced into first person view. Also, they fixed an issue where achievements related to POIs, including delves, world bosses, and dolmens, sometimes would incorrectly display as being incomplete on the map after you first load in. I know a lot of people were complaining about this. They were saying that you know, it was showing a lot of different things uh, not being done. Uh, I, I noticed on my particular map that it was showing world bosses and even like some of the public dungeons not being completed. Hopefully that will be uh, fixed now. All that will be shown correctly on screen or at least on your map when you're looking, you know, kind of at the overall map of Tamriel. Anyway, guys, leave me a comment with your thoughts. Let me know if you're having any issues or if any of the things that I talked about you're still experiencing problems with here on console. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you hadn't subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.